Okay, the question is, for Medicare patient, shouldn't the reason for surgery be documented, not the type of surgery? And the answer is, um, this is, does not pertain just to Medicare, it's for any payer. And basically, on the surgical report at the very top, uh, the reason for the surgery translates into the preoperative diagnosis. Why is the person having surgery? The header of the surgical report, which is the very top of the report, should include the pre- and post-operative diagnosis codes, as well as the surgical procedure performed. And you would use the header information to begin searching for your appropriate CPT procedure codes, as well as your diagnosis, the ICD-10 CM codes. Um, so really, it it really should include the diagnosis as well as the procedures. Um, after you um, get that information, what you would do is um, review the operative report. So you first begin with, I look up the diagnosis and um, the procedure and diagnosis codes from the manual based on the header, but then I go right into the operative report. And then what I do is I extract all the information out of it. You know, I scan quickly because there may be other procedures that are in that operative report that can be coded. Um, sometimes they're bundled in um, to the main surgery, but that's not always the case. So the header is a consolidation of the surgery performed, not a step-by-step description of what was done and then after you've chosen your codes you review the guidelines you know in both CPT and ICD-10 and then use any appropriate modifiers based on documentation if it's the left right bilateral and then you want to see if the surgical procedure is staged like modifier 58 or return to the OR for a complication 78 but basically you really want to have the, um, the diagnosis as well as the procedure at the top, along with the patient's name, date of birth, medical record number, and so forth. If you want more extensive information, I've given you a link to the cms.gov website, and you can check there, and it'll, you'll have that broken down even more. But any doctor that writes just the diagnosis or the type of surgery, that's really that's up to you as a coder to educate them and to have it right. I mean, it's hard. I mean, you really should have it all together properly. Okay, so. Yeah, I think um, that we just did CDI, some CDI education, that, that falls right into that, doesn't it? Yeah. Okay. Do you need more medical certification and business training? Learn more at www.cco.us.